remember yes yes this is spontana life oh we are again what we have is sweet peppers and we, we, we try our best this is for educational purposes only right we try our, our best to grow the sweet peppers our veg vegetables that we cultivate with as little sometimes well uh, no synthetic pesticide as possible you know so what we do intermix it with uh, this is celery so the, the the animal the bugs the insect they don't like the smell of celery so you plant them even a row between us plant them between the vegetable like whether you are the cabbage you know pop chai kalalo you know so this is the celeries I have the the bed they will put, put them on fires and why we put them on as far as because this helps to prevent the root rot because once the roots are surrounded by water they can't get to breathe because the plants breathe from the leaves and their root so once you plant it at a spot where the water settles then you are gonna have problem low production and you're gonna see your plants dying and getting yellow leaves right so tune in i'll update you as the process goes by and remember stay organic as best as possible you know when you look at this this is a blossom right the first blossom so what you want to do pick that out right this allows the plant to put on more body because if you allow this if you allow this sweet pepper to blast to uh, mature the plant will will put all of its energy into developing this fruit so pluck them out and you will see like i said you will see you have a stronger plant and you will see as time goes by you know get them here from a nursery nursery in St. Mary. so i mean i get i have a couple nurses around the place you know go buy plants from. so i have a spontan idea like share and subscribe like share and subscribe Set up a tank then if we put users on the harvest water. I mean, I'll build a shed still. So, so we have white apple yam growing. Yeah. White apple. And they are the celery plants. You know, they are natural insect repellent. Use them in a green juice too. These are the yams, the yam white apple. Similar to yellow yam, as you can see there. The vines are similar. Similar. Yeah. See, I'll see more, more sweet peppers. So, use, as I say, so these are parsley. Uh, 
put some slurries out here to see them. So we try our best. Look at look at look at them. So they are planting rice beds. I plant them so about two feet apart. Yeah. Two to three feet apart. Some people say mass shape length. Uh, it's wider than a mass shape length. So bravo, we can walk and the pumpkin the probably have to go remove. Yeah, probably. So we have to wash them, but so we don't want to use them. Look at that wash there. You know, the what I load it, they bite me. But the wash is a natural insect predator, and he hunts the insect. As I see, he's searching. He's searching. He's searching the plants for insects. So, six feet. So this, the, the parcels are, yeah, they are looking good, you know. So I'm gonna put some fillers along along the forest. You know what this race beds. We just use race beds. And the corn also, we can in there now. The fine set them take the corn empty. But then I trouble the trouble the the the, the, the sweet potatoes, sweet peppers, and see so here again. You want to remove this. See? You want to remove it. Once you see the art of the sweet pepper, of that. It's like all this stay you now, yeah. So it will put the energy in all of them branches there. And you put, we use not only, and there's another was again, feed. So I don't want to use it synthetic insecticide to kill out the, the natural. The natural. So we have a kills all oh, these type of mixed cropping. I want on the farm to cook and eat. Uh, cook and eat. Here is another look. This is like I said, you want to not have. I mean, we, 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 you, for your plants to grow big and put on body because and help to produce more fruit. You, have, you want to pluck this out. You have to pluck it out. Here it is. A small fruit coming. So you want to pluck that out. Yeah. So I'm going through a lesson with you guys. You want to do it. You don't want to leave these on the plants. You don't want to. There is more. You don't want to leave them. Yeah, you don't want to. You, you want to remove them. So you get bigger plants. And bigger plants deal with more fruit so there is there is the 
I will soon start feeding on these because once I eat them, yeah, it, they put on different and I have basil. That's it. They are natural insect repellent. Natural. This is how the, the cellar is. Natural. Now we have some okras too. So that is it, peeps. Like, share, and subscribe. Help the channel go a long way. And thanks for the support, people all over the world. Have a wonderful and blessed day. Right. And I keep on updating you as as the plants grow so you will see when I'm reaping them see insects you know the, the borewolves I've not found the culprit yet but one day I'll find the culprit yeah so the celeries are, you know, all getting up, all looking good. So see, got that, and they start producing. They look good. The leaves. This is what you want: green leaves. Green leaves.